Federal authorities say a daycare owner who left Houston for Nigeria after a deadly fire at her business has returned to the U.S. According to family members, Jessica Tata turned herself in to the U.S. consulate. Tata arrived in Atlanta early Monday and is being held in a county jail until she's picked up by Texas officials. She went back to her native Nigeria late last month following a fire that killed four children and injured three others. Authorities say the 22-year-old woman left the victims alone while she shopped at a nearby store. According to the Houston Chronicle, the fire was started by oil left cooking on a stovetop burner. There is no point in trying to rationalize or find answers. It will only lead to more bitterness. They will not bring back Elizabeth. Tata has been charged with manslaughter, injury to a child, and child abandonment. Interpol agents were able to find her based on leads from several sources, including Houston fire investigators and the U.S. State Department. The U.S. Marshals Service had put her on a list of the 15 most wanted fugitives and offered a reward of up to $25,000. The agency gave no indication of whether the reward had been claimed or would be paid. Rita Foley, The Associated Press.